Die, you fool. Yeah, this young Grex is going down easy. Burn. Nice blaze effect. Whenever Elma attacks, like, its health just drops a lot. I pressed B by mistake. My bad. Lynn, why did you take so much damage? Don't do that. Stop taking damage right now. Come here, you. I'm going to slit edge you. Let's go. Slit. Oh, no. I accidentally moved a little bit. There we go. Slit edge. Nice damage. Let's also do this for some defense. And then switch back to my gun. Oh, it's dead. Sweet. Give me your stuff. Advanced survival head suit. Advanced survival shirt. Awesome. Sounds useful. I think that's what I'm going to try and do in my spare time is just find some enemies like that that are decent leveled but off on their own. Like this one right here. Let's find another one. This one's level 9. One level higher. I can take one level higher. Here we go. Yeah, here we go. Now we're talking. Die, you young Grex. Die, I say. Yeah, stagger him. Stagger him good. I'm going to get him with the ye olden slit edge. There we go. Did I get the perfect? Oh, I missed the perfect. Die. Die, you fool. You look like you could go for a blaze shot in your butt. Take this. There we go. Nice 295 damage. I love it. Whoa, where did it go? Don't jump like that. Who said you could make that long jump? It's not okay, man. Pistol whip. Do, 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 do. Look at this glorious damage. Oh, no. Where are you going? Oh, my goodness. Why did that do so much damage? You guys need to kill that thing right now. Kill it right now. What was that howl? You better not have summoned more enemies. Can you guys please kill it in the next 23 seconds? It, like, o code me. It did, like, a 1,000 damage out of nowhere. I was not expecting that. Please kill it. Come on, it's almost dead, and you guys have got, like, 14 seconds to kill it. Yeah, there you go, there you go. Finish it, finish it, finish it, finish it. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, I got a level up. I still got experience for that. I was afraid I wouldn't get the EXP. Woo! So I think this way should be the correct path. Woohoo! Uh, do not take Cliffside Beach. Nice. Get some, uh, whatchamacallit for that. Let's ignore those guys. Let's go get this natural mineral over here, though. But uh, I believe this way should lead me to the uh, Janpath Plain. I think. Only way to find out is to go over there and see. Give me this. Whatever this is. Biological. Yeah. I don't know what this does for me. I think it gives me some EXP and some money, doesn't it? Uh, two battle points, 20 experience gained. Decent enough. Run, boy, run. We got places to be, things to do. Got to take all this mechanical who's a what's it's to these guys. What the heck is that? Look at that giant freak. Oh my goodness. You'd have to have a scale to take on that thing. Look at how big that is. It's probably like level 186. There are multiple of them too. They're so big. Like holy cow. Oh no, wait. What's this uh, exclamation mark? Is that the uh, mission I'm trying to do? Oh uh, yeah, it says Miles. Oh, what sees me? A little suit. I need to fight little suits. Awesome. Oh, no, there, there's a big suit. Uh, well, we better start attacking. Little suit is uh, pretty low health, it seems. Oh, we're fighting like a bunch. This reminds me of the uh, Armu on Guar Plains. I didn't mean to use that right then, but oh well. Get some damage off. I need to kill some stuff fast. One of these little suits needs to die. I should probably do this defense buff. There we go. Die, I say time for another slit edge get you from the side there you go 144 I went down again how do I keep like I was at 500 HP like all of a sudden they start doing one hit KOs oh I got up yes why am I not attacking and now Lin is down this is not good yeah there are too there are too many enemies we gotta we gotta bail we gotta bail too many bail out bail out I have a feeling that that wouldn't be a very hard fight if there was only one enemy rather than numerous. I'm running away. Are they still... Oh, I'm going to go down. How are they hitting me when... How? How are they hitting me when I was that far away? Whatever. It's over now. I don't care. I'm clearly not... Yeah, that thing was level 11. No wonder it was causing so many problems. What's up, Miles? Yo. Hey, little help over here. Some indigent attacked us during our assignment. Got one of my men pretty good. Skell's busted too. Dang thing won't move at all. Think maybe you could spare some supplies? Oh, Sadie sent you? 
Whoa, why didn't you say so instead of letting me flap my gums like an idiot? Here, give me the supplies. I need to get the skill uh, patch pronto. There you go, buddy. Thanks, pal. You're a lifesaver. I asked Sadie for help, but I wasn't exactly eating my hopes up. Know what I mean? I'm impressed you made it out here in one piece. Uh, say how easy the trip was for a blade like yourself. Shrug and tell Miles that you got lucky. I don't want to say either of these. I don't want to brag and seem like a douche, but I don't want to downplay it and make it seem like I got lucky. Like, nah, it wasn't, like, super difficult to get here, other than when that, like, f group of four attacked me. But it wasn't easy either. It wasn't like a cakewalk. Like, both of these are horrible options. I would just be like, uh, yeah, man. You're welcome. Like, I wouldn't really, I wouldn't really reply to that, honestly. I'm impressed you made it out here in one piece. I would probably just say, yeah, you know. I wouldn't brag about it or, like, say that I got lucky. I'd rather say I got lucky than brag about it and be a douche. I apparently got some kind of affinity with Elma for doing that. Lucky, right. Well, we sure as heck weren't. That indigen turned up out of nowhere. How the heck do you... How the heck did you beat the Whimsical Dougal anyway? That thing was huge. What, you made it all the way here without running into it? Not even once? Yeesh, either somebody's watching after you or somebody's got it in for us, one or the other. Wait, that means that dang Whimsical Dougal's still on the rampage somewhere. Talk about bad piece of news. Uh, not every blade's as lucky as you, you know. We've got to take that thing out before it kills someone. What do you say? I think that luck of yours is good enough to beat a whimsical doogle. Me, I want to sock the giant lug right in its ugly face. I'm sure you know how frustrating it is to have your summit put on hold. Do this for a fellow blade, secure the route, and kick that ugly thing right in the teeth. I'll be here waiting for all the juicy details. Defeat the whimsical doogle on the west... Ah, great. Is it this thing over here? Is it that thing right there? Oh, no, it's that thing right there. Is that it? That's only level 9. I can take that thing on. Look at that thing. That thing is level 90 frigging 2. I can hear it drinking from over here. Well, this Dougal's got to go down. You got to die. This is actually... This is looking really well. Look at how much damage it's already taken. Dang. And I've got the high ground. I got the high ground, son. Oh, my goodness. Look at this, Gloria. You're dying. You're going down. We got this. No, don't look at me. Sorry for me. Ah, that's decent damage, actually. Can you not do that much, please? I wish I better understood how my uh, healing ability worked so I could use it more effectively. Jeez, that did a lot. I gotta back up a little bit. Die, I say. Take this burn. Oh my goodness, the damage. I need some HP. Yeah, aim at someone who's not me. Good thing that I can shoot through rocks occasionally. Die, you whimsical doogle. You're so close to dead. No, don't attack me. Don't attack me. Leave me alone. I still can't do my Healy thing. Is it almost dead? Oh, it's almost dead. We got this. Ah, oh, crap. It took me down. Dang it. I really need to level up some. There we go. Good job, guys. Good job. Base experience 47. Not bad. Let's go back over here to... Uh, I almost lived through that whole fight. I only got taken down at the last second just before I died. I definitely want to do some leveling up in my spare time. If I can. Well, you beat that whimsical doogal into next week yet? Hold on now. Judging from the air of confidence and the smug grin on your face, I'd say that baby's six feet under. Well, shoot. That's music to my ears. You clear the path and made my day to boot. Pretty impressive stuff. I really gotta thank you. Well, while you're off fighting, I was working on the scale. Almost got it all patched up. Looks like we'll be getting back to work without losing much time, thanks to you. We'll brag these... We'll bang. I said brag. We'll bang these data probes in at the Frontier Nav Probe sites and be back home in time for supper. Hopefully the indigen data they turn out will make sure no one else gets another nasty surprise. Uh, give Miles plan the thumbs up. Ask Miles where the Frontier Nav place is. I'm just gonna give him a thumbs up. He's doing a good job. I got another affinity with, apparently, like, me and Elma think the exact same. Hey, thanks. The Pathfinders are an elite group even by Blade standards, which means average schlubs like me have gotta work extra hard to keep up. And that means it's time for me to patch this scale up and get back to work. Some planet we picked to crash into, huh? Huh, <laughs> it's easy to forget how nuts this place is until you get your butt handed to you by some giant monster. I mean, for the foreseeable future, we're probably going to be fighting things that can easily crush skulls. I gotta remember to be a lot more careful, or I'm going to wind up a lot more dead. No more working mistakes for me from here on out. You be careful too, yeah? Let's both of us live a long, long time. See where humanity goes, you know? Uh, that's my plan. I plan on living a long, long time. Alright, cool. So that mission is uh, accomplished. Not bad. Not bad. Alright, and I got affinity up with both of them. Good. Good job, mate. Man, I'm so good. Alright. Really quick, I'm gonna. I did not mean to lock onto that thing, but I did. So let's move past that. Let me see if I can fast travel back into town. Is there a way I can do that? There's like no hexagon. Can I fast travel to like the front entrance? No, I can't. That's really irritating. 
can fast travel to the west gate and walk in. Let's do that. Walk in from the west. I can't transfer to the east gate, though, for some reason. Who is Skype messaging me at 1.47 a.m.? Did one of my British friends just wake up and say something? Like, what? What is that? All right, we're at the west gate now. Okay. This is actually slightly further away than I anticipated it to be. Is the west gate actually open, or do I still have to take the freight elevator? It looks like it's actually open. There are a bunch of really low-level enemies. I probably should have, like, when I first came through here, grinded up against some of these. That's probably why I'm a little behind on levels right now. I think what I'm going to have to do from now on is just every, like, two or three sessions, I'll have to grind up a certain amount of levels to make sure I stay on par with the uh, enemies I'm up against. And that's what I'm going to try and do. I'm going to try and grind up some levels in between this session and the next, if I can. I really hope I do, because like I said, I'm having to do baseboard stuff tomorrow, Saturday, the day this is going up. And I need to record another session sometime tomorrow to make sure I get enough videos up. So really hoping I have the time to. Otherwise, we're not going to have fun times the next time. But I should be able to do it in the morning before I start working on baseboards. And then in the afternoon, I'll record. And, uh, whatchamacallit. I think what I'm actually about to do is I'm about to save and wrap up. And when we come back next time, I'll have leveled up. And I'll probably be back at where uh, Glenar is. And we can take on Glenar. Commercial district. What a beautiful place. We're level. Oh, I'm level 8 now, actually. We're all level 8, I think. Good. So I actually have gotten some level ups from fighting. There is another red question mark over here. I believe that means a, uh, a side mission. Justin. Hey, how's it going, man? What's up, Justin? These guys look like gang members. Their car is totaled. It's one weird looking car. Oh, it just like, just like loaded in. Yeah, this car's your this car yours, buddy? Then it's your own fault. Blade ain't allowed to park here, see? Well, well, I heard rumors there were ruffians going about hounding blades, and now here you are. This is my lucky day. Let me guess, you rocket scientists used to be blades yourselves, right? But something set you off, so you left to form this gang. How pathetic. And here I was thinking you'd be something special when you're just a common pack of thugs. It's almost disappointing. You got a big mouth, Pip Squeak. I bet it would look better if I knocked out a few teeth. Please, I have no interest in low-level chumps like you. I fear I'm something of a traditionalist, you see. Either give me a great evil worthy of facing justice, or don't waste my time. Enough with the fancy talk. Put up your dukes before I end you. Oh, I Wally... I, why did I say that, Wally? I wholly... I didn't recognize the word until after I said Wally. I wholly encourage you to try. But be warned, agents of swift justice always step forth after Trump drops a cheesy line like that. Uh, step... Step forth? I'm gonna step forth. Let's do it. See? Prove this guy right. More blades? Pfft, this was supposed to be an unfair fight. Why are you wussing out on us like this? You got lucky today, Blade. Might not be so lucky tomorrow if you get my drift. Come on, boys. Let's make, like, bananas and split. Oh, my goodness. People still say that in 2054? That's so unfortunate. Phew. Thank you. I think you just saved my teeth. I heard talk about a gang that was causing mischief around here, so I decided to take a look, and believe you me, I didn't need to look for very long. But alas, those ruffians saw fit to wreck my ride. I'm at a bit of a loss as what to do about that. Uh, express sympathy for Justin's predicted. Ask Justin to tell you about his attackers. Uh, I'll, I'll, uh, I want to know about the attackers. Uh, what's to tell? I got more affinity with... Apparently everything I do is exactly what Elmo would do. What's to tell? I'd hope they were villains of vision and character, but they turned out to be common street thugs. Not to say this whole incident has been a waste, though. I met you, and you seem to be something of a major player. I'm, I'm kind of the main character of the game. Oh, I almost forgot. My name is Justin, and I'm a blade. It's good to meet you. And you're a solo, huh? Well, you've got yourself a new fan, Solo. Awesome. Since you seem to be cut from the cloth of the hero, do you think you could help me find some replacement parts for my poor car? With the right parts, I'll have it repaired in no time. I'll just stay here and think of some heroic questions for you while you're gone. Look forward to it. Okay. Uh, what parts do I need? Gather two uh, Hydrus radiators. All right. I'll take it. Uh, yeah, sure. Set it as my navigation target. I knew you'd accept you're the type they always say yes no matter how absurd the request may be. It's because you're an agent of justice. I thought that said angel. Uh, such things are in your DNA. It's almost 2 a.m. for me. Uh, puff up your chest and agree vehemently. Shake your head and admit that you're no hero. They're always, like, two extremes. Like, there's never no mid-ground. It's either, like, you're full-on, like, oh, yeah, I'm I'm the bomb. Or you're like, oh, no, I'm, I'm worthless, like, self-pity. I want, like, a healthy medium. 
but it only gives me the extremes. Uh, I prefer the term anti-hero, so I'm just going to say hero. I'm no hero. The classic hero response. Bold of action, yet humble of spirit. One that, such as yourself would never brag about your daring do. Daring do? In any case, uh, what I need is a pair of Hadrus Radiators. Got it. Thanks a million, hero. Awesome. All right. We will do that next time. For now, let's go ahead and save and call it a day. Bum bum. Yes. Over a previous save data. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I am hopefully going to find the time to do some leveling up in between now and the next session. And uh, what level am I? I'm like level 8, right? Yeah, it looks like everyone is 8. Uh, rank 9 for me. Rank 6 for Elmo. Rank 5 for Lynn. I don't know the difference between rank and level and what roles those play. But, uh... Oh, no, 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 no. Wait a minute. Rank is green? Is rank green? Wait a minute. I can't tell. Uh, let me look at that real quick. Party. Uh, do I have it backwards? I might have it backwards. Status. Uh, no, no, no. Wait, yes. I'm level 8, my rank is 9. No, 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 that's right. Yeah, purple is rank, green is... I look down there, you see down there the little green symbol uh, at the bottom right beneath where it says division, and it has level 8, and it has rank 9. I thought that I had them backwards, but no. Okay, so the green at the top left, green bar is level, purple bar is rank. So I am level 8. I'm going to try and get to about level 10. And at least, at least level 10, maybe a little bit higher. But that will let me take on what's-his-face, uh, Glenar, and hopefully defeat him. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Until then, farewell.